Hey guys, Cam J18 here, bringing you guys with a very exciting minifigure today. We have Kylo Ren from Star Wars Episode 7. And I just want to start off this video by apologizing for not putting up a video with me talking in it for um, a little while. Um, I'm sure I said in the last video where I actually talked in it that um, I have my last ACT coming up. And I have that in a few weeks, guys. And I'm like really nervous, I stressed for it. And I have schoolwork to worry about too. So if I don't get videos up in like these next like few weeks um, with me talking or exactly on the days that I'm like supposed to upload, I apologize. It's not going to last much longer. It's just until I'm done with this test. And um, the reason I actually have time to record this video today well, actually, I'm recording this on Wednesday, but I'm going to upload it Thursday because I'm trying really hard to stay on schedule with the uh, Tuesday, Thursday, and Saturday uploads. So, yeah, enough blah, blah, blah. Let's get into the video. So, I'm going to show you guys today how to make your own Kylo Ren. And I made one a long time ago for my um, Star Wars 7 trailer. Um, but in that trailer, you couldn't see what Kylo Ren's face looked like. And... Because no one knew what it looks like. Everyone just saw the back of him as he's going through the forest. But now that everyone knows what he looks like, even Legos made their own. Um, of course, I really want the, the real Lego one. And I'm sure a lot of you guys do too. But as you guys know, that set is pretty darn expensive. And um, I don't know when I'm going to get it. So I'd like to have something in the meantime. And I'm sure a lot of you guys... Um, would like that too considering uh, you might not get that set until Christmas or something because it is pretty expensive I think it's like seventy dollars or something um, <clears throat> but without further ado let's get started with how you can make your own so we'll start off with the top here um, this helmet is from Ninjago from a skeleton um, it's very cool it's like the only um, army hat that Lego has made and then below it we have um, I don't know which kind of um, what kind of uh, trooper it is, but um, here we actually I might have the body for it. One second. Uh, oh great. Um. Hold up. Ah uh, da da da. Okay. It's like one of these guys. This, I don't know what they're called, like a Thai bomber fighter or something. Oh, here he is. Here he is, I found him. Uh, this is the guy that you will need the uh, headpiece for. Um, it's the closest thing, without using stickers, that I could think of to make the um, his unique looking face. And then I used a black um, neckerchief there. Um, because if you look at pictures of him, you can see he's got kind of like a... <coughs> It looks like um, a neckerchief a little bit. And then here we have his, um, his kind of like side cape, his uh, pauldron, I believe it's called. And um, I had to make that custom, of course. Um, if you guys remember when I made my Lego Batman versus uh, Superman um, Dawn of Justice custom minifigure for the Batman, I gave him this like really unique looking cape that I had to cut up, so... I just used that for the side pauldron. It's a little big, but um, it's pretty cool. And then the torso is from a Shadow Trooper. Those minifigures are kind of rare. And then um, black legs, black arms, black hands, and then the lightsaber. I'll take it off so you guys can see. Um, I used this like telescope looking piece. And then uh, you have the red lightsaber. If you have... Um, this lightsaber piece in a solid red color, not translucent. It looks a lot better, but I couldn't find mine, uh, so I just used the translucent. And then you have the little red hands there. You just stick it together, and then that's the closest thing you can get to um, the lightsaber with um, three lightsabers. <laughs> so, also, let me know what you guys think of the new movie. Are you going to see it in theaters, or are you going to wait till it comes out on DVD? What's your opinion on this new Sith? 
And just thank you guys for watching. Um, if you guys enjoyed this video, please make sure to smack that like button. And um, leave an awesome comment. I love reading comments. And check out my Twitter for news and updates with my channel on previews. The link will be in the description. So, and subscribe. Thank you for watching.